No matter where I go, Lord, I just want to be with you. No matter where I go, Lord, I just want to be with you. I'll run miles and miles for you, Lord. I'll climb higher and higher for you. I'll dive into the deepest ocean just to have a glimpse of your love, my God. You're the one I dream of. Thank you so much for watching, clicking on this video. I just want you to know that the power of 316, for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believes in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. You know, that's like the foundation of Christianity. We hear that all the time. And sometimes when you hear something all the time, you forget about it. You don't think it's as important. That's the foundation of everything we do, of everything we live for, because God so loved the world. And I want you to know that because God loves you so much, he's going to give you what you ask, what he, what you're asking him for. He's going to give you that blessed life. He's going to give you your heart's desires because he loves you. And it gives him the pleasure to give you the kingdom. It gives him great pleasure to give you the kingdom. God's not a God of of fear. He's not a God of chastisement. He's a God of peace. He's a God of hope. He's a God of love. And he just wants you to just dive into him, go into that secret place. And of course, as we grow closer to, to God, our desires are going to mesh with his desires. But he's saying, just come to him, ask what you want, ask and you shall receive. Just come by faith Know that the Lord is good and that he has a plan for you. He has a plan for your life and that he knows your hurt. He knows your pain and he's coming to rescue you. He's coming to rescue you and everything that you went through, it's going to be a beautiful, your story, your, your past, your hurts. It's going to be a beautiful story of unraveling. It's going to be like a, a box that was hidden and at a, a point in time in the future, then you can open it like a time capsule, you know? When I see um, Avatar The Last Airbender is on Netflix, I was watching it with my boyfriend. I never watched it when it was on when I was in junior high, but now the world is seeing it and they're saying it's one of the best television shows of all time, especially animated. See, sometimes, I mean, it was always great, but sometimes you don't see the greatness until the end. God says he sees you, he loves you, and the greatness of God is about to shine through in your life. Just tell him what you want. He hears and he knows.